Hi everyone, welcome to Worst Film Reviews, I'm Lorenzo Keys. Today we're looking back at three classic Luxembourgish movies about one of the country's biggest obsessions, the automobile. The first movie on our list is from the early 2000s. In it, a group of maniacs in fast cars speed around like legal street racers who think they rule the roads. No, these aren't the young French guys with tuned up Peugeots, these are angry middle-aged men in 100,000 euro vehicles. That's right, the movie is The Fat and the Furious. We're taken on the ride with these overweight, angry men who go around on a mission. To never let a small car merge in front of them and to always take up two parking spots. Why? Because they can. Then one day, they face their biggest challenge yet. Getting stuck on route alone behind a car going a speed limit. The second movie is a 1976 classic that follows a lonely taxi driver who has a brief relationship with a beautiful career woman. And when she ends up refusing him, he gives himself a weird haircut. That's right, I'm talking about airport taxi driver. The air of friendliness turns sour, however, when the woman accuses the driver of not taking the fastest route. Things get really bad when the taxi driver drops the woman off at her home in Kirchberg and demands 230 euros. An argument ensues in which the two parties shout at each other in all the local languages. The taxi driver loses his mind, goes home and shaves his head into the movie's iconic mohawk. And the last film we're looking at today is the newest of the lot, Made in 2014, this reboot takes place in a dystopian future where gangs of bandits run wild and only one man in a chunky car has the grit and know-how to take on the reigning warlords. Yes, the movie I'm referring to is The Melemax. It's the near future and the creation of corporate taxes in Luxembourg has wreaked havoc on the finance sector, causing investors to flee to tax-friendlier countries. Ruling this nightmarish land is a gang of rogue fund managers who ride around on electric scooters. That is, until they steal a client from the wrong guy. Max, a hungry client relationship manager, desperate for revenge, in an old fort that would never pass control technique, decides to chase down the unscrupulous fund managers one by one. And that's it for today. Thank you for joining us and please watch next time when we look at one of Luxembourg's classic gangster movies from the 90s, Boys in the Grunt.